Richard. Uh, oh yeah, I knew it. Det er så gammel, ja. Oh my god. Hey. You know, one secret I have. What? I know she's the mother. Oh god. It's gonna be interesting. Someone knows the answer. Someone oh my god, I am know. so happy. Oh, she's streaming. No, no, no. She came to friend's house to sleep. She yeah, ran away from the house. Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> so yeah, is gonna complain about the way she made <laughs> Strange like She's gonna know. She probably haven't. She haven't read it. <laughs> when I want to know what happened with Uyongu and that guy. Why are you telling her? Thank you. I do, I do. He's just awesome. He wants her to be strong. Wow. They never do this in America. Bad timing. Where did you sell that? I consent. 
이거 이 마음을 아 이거 이거 아무 동의한 거 아니에요. 저기 사모님도 장님도 동의를 했다고. 자 반장님 이건 주민들을 분열시켜서 소송에서 이기려는 피고 대리인의 꼼수입니다 수급 동안 이장님의 입김이 너무 세서 힘없는 주민들이 제 목소리를 내기가 힘든 것입니다 동의서를 통해서 남아 용기를 내서 자기들의 뜻을 밝히고자 하는 주민들의 마음을 헤아려 주시기 바랍니다 일단은 현장을 보는 것에 집중하겠습니다 최종 변호사들이 어디까지 손을 써는지 알수 없으니까 주민들 소개는 그만하는 게 좋겠습니다 택량번호 바로 가시죠 He might change his mind when he sees that tree. And when they tried to give them umbrella like this, you say America never do that. No, I'm talking about America. America will never bring a judge to come out. Ah, okay, never. okay. Never. Ah. 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 Ah.
she'll give her dad what he doesn't want. Told you. Exactly what he didn't want. That's what she's doing. I knew it. Oh my god. Why does he do that? But I don't know what's gonna happen. How come she doesn't know? Oh. This was what I was talking about. This was what I wanted to, to see. What happened? This was what I was looking for. How you feel now? Okay. I don't know yet. <laughs> Sometimes they don't take uh, things very serious as you. You think you worry about what you are not gonna take it. 정현석 변호사님, 저희 아버지 생각에는 이 세상 모든 것이 다 정치적입니다. 모든 결정 뒤에는 정치적인 이유가 숨어 있기 마련이고요. 정현석 변호사님, 주무십니까? 오전 오사 지금 몇 시인 줄 알아요? 오전 3시 10분입니다. 오전 3시 10분에는 다들 자는 시간 아닌가? 새들도 아가양도 명석이도 네? 네 얘기합시다. 안녕. 어. 벌든 레벨 명석이 되고 싶었니? 그러면 두분 여기서 잠깐만 기다려 주실래요? 제가 자료 금방 찾아가지고 올게요. 네. It's like he didn't file the report or something. Or she did. He didn't do what he's supposed to do. I feel it. I feel it. 이준호 씨를 전혀 만지지 않았는데도 심장이 매우 빠르게 뛰었습니다. 좋아하는 게 맞는 것 같습니다. How can you not love her? He already does, so he's just looking for a good way to communicate it. 저는요. 설마 도망치는 겁니까? 네. 박유진 씨가 도망칩니다. 잠깐만요. But why is he running away? 왜 그러지? so he wanted change.
어디 큰 돌고래 같다고 생각하실 수도 있겠지만 본성인 날씨 타고 길쭉하니 무슨 소리 하는 겁니까? 그 돌고래는 남방 큰그 남방 큰 돌고래는 경포 건설의 로고입니다. 저 저지 캔나피다 저. 어디 모델이요? 내가 한국 신도시의 아파트를 사려고 그 모델 하우스에 갔다가 그 말입니까? 불공평한 재판을 하실 염려가 있기에. Conflict of interest. 사람의 마음처럼 나약한 건 없으니까요. 저를 알아보지 못하시겠습니까? 네? 저는 우강호 씨의 딸입니다. 어머니의 회사로 갈 수는 없으니까요. 그것도 딸을 낳았지만 나를 버렸고 지금도 날 전혀 알아보지 못하는 그런 어머니한테요. 나를 원망했네. 소덕동 언덕 위에서 함께 나무를 바라봤을 때 좋았습니다. 한 번은 만나보고 싶었어요. 만나서 반갑습니다. 경기도 대영시 소덕동에 있는 팽나무가 천연 기념물로 지정 예고됐습니다. 이 팽나무 I kind of guessed that this was going to happen. So it's kind of nice to see how they, the director put it together beautifully. So sad though. I mean, interesting person to be thoughtful of someone else and say you want this baby so much i'm going to take nine months give you this baby and i'm going to move on who knows what was in her mind she might not want to run for me for you know the office anymore someone you admired so much turns out to be your own blood you know it's so sad though her dad had to go through the tough times like that you know yeah what did you think? I was not happy with her because she opened the door. You know, all the kicks and you feel the baby inside your body. And then you give to him and never ever meet them again. Even though you have your son. Every time your son five years old, seven years old, you might think about, oh my girl, I hate that girl, how she will be. Every person. So I didn't want to be too critical of her. I don't know, maybe my story, the way my story mm came about was I have a father that was very strict right you know and there's no way I could right. break my father's heart by telling him I'm pregnant or something like there's just no end and and I wasn't ready when a woman is not ready you don't force her kind of disappointed how you know why director made daddy to just to slip out the world kind of like that kind of situation when young was not ready but i kind of understand everything because she has to think about the, the three political reasons everything that's why he put it that way i think it was a good job to be honest to just say it like that and introduce it a little bit i i really like the story and she did a good job i was gonna say how come you don't cry? You see that. Her eyes were teary. But then, towards the end, her emotions showed. I thought she did a good job. Well, you would did a good job, too, in just playing her part. But very shocking. I think my mouth was like, oh, and I heard. I'm like, I knew it, but I knew it. But I was just, and it was just like, boom. <laughs> Yeah, interesting. So in the end, they won. They won. I mean, it's like, you know, who always wins. You know, I always want to make a super power book with uh, some autism. That's my, like, 
um, a bucket list. A bucket list. My bucket list was writing book, introduce the world autism is a kind of superpower, they helping people. So it's like Uyung, but she is a hero, but with her brain. When Superman come there and they change their uniform, and when Batman coming there, bat is you know, flying around. But Uyung is a Dolphin, I mean, whale. And then she doesn't have to change her uniform, but way over they connected, like she changed to have some superpower. So it's very interesting. Mm -hmm. And they're helping people solve mm -hmm. the problem. It's like a superhero. How they connect with this autism, you know, the spectrum behave and things. It's just awesome. It's like watching superhero movie. You know what I love about Korean movies is that they find a way to make a very very interesting movie without being obscene. In America, for you to really capture people and the attention, it has to be something about sex and drugs uh. and something. Nice stories put together for the mass audience. You know, I just think it's brilliant. I think because Korean broadcast have a high rule, like um, if you showing smoking, you cannot broadcast. You cannot show so TV. So yeah, 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 yeah. Highly restricted. Yeah, so, so you mean Korean don't have like R-rated movies? <laughs> there are mean? some channel, but usually they have a highly restricted. For I, adults, I, I, for adults as well? I really don't have an idea that much because I left Korea like yeah. you know but in my time if you have a tattoo maybe. you cannot show it in the TV show I think that this is a maybe story now this is a good opportunity for you know the audience to let us know what, right you know, yeah I think that is you know, yeah you know if Koreans have like R-rated movies because I'm, I'm interested <laughs> I would like to see. they say it's bad for the teenager audience so if you you have like a red hair or something. I, you have to wear hat totally, to be I, in, in I, the TV I show. I totally get it. But I am curious if Koreans have an R-rated industry. It would be very interesting if they don't. I just think... <laughs> Please let us know. <laughs> I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. What was the theme, do you think? There, were, there, were, there was a lot going on from episode seven and then eight there was a lot about what is good for for society versus sentimental values um how long can you keep sentimental values i mean i understand the tree but is it possible to serve the masses by somehow preserving that like a national treasure mm -hmm. because eventually that tree might die but i mean that tree is probably thousands of years old because remember the guy that made up the impossibility to make that monument, right? The reason he did that was because he wanted modernization. Mm -hmm. There's always some reason people do things. So there's that. There is the connection of her mom. There's just so much to unpack there. I thought that was a huge highlight. I like the highlight of her connecting and trying to find some kind of um, emotional connection with um, um, the guy she works with <laughs> it was, it was very interesting it was that guy's concern nepotism you know not liking the fact that Oyang Wu may have gotten a job as a result of her dad knowing the CEO I felt a little disappointed that he didn't consider her skill set what she was doing for the team and that personal mission of actually going out there to make public other people's business but what about you yeah mm. so into there too when she say you mm. are protecting me from all of my failures. failures right you need to let me fail so yeah. because i'm an adult right yeah i feel like it's a message from my son said it to me because sometimes I overprotect him. It's like a heartbroken, you know, when uh -huh. he's dealing with the friends and every time when somebody have some issue with him, I always go there. What happened? Mm -hmm. I don't give him a time to dealing with it sometimes. Yes, I know. That's why I really connected when Wuyong would say that mm -hmm. to daddy. Mm -hmm. 
And what I like about Onyong Wu is she is pressing along. Even though she's seen difficulties, the story of her mom, the disappointment from her dad, all this stuff, it's hitting her. But one thing I know that's consistent with her is she keeps moving forward. It looks like she's always wanting to prove to people that she's good. She knows she's good, but it feels like she always have to prove. Mm. You know, sometimes it feels like that in life sometimes. But you don't focus on things like that. You just think about what's possible, right? Mm -hmm. Think about other ways to make things happen. Don't ask for less problems. Ask for more skills, right? You know, it's funny. Do you remember the first time we were thinking about what we're going to watch? We didn't even know anything, anything about, about this. Yes. When I pick trauma, I don't even look at any columns, any I mean, articles. So we can yeah. have our reaction, right? Mm. And I want you to inform the world the, what you what you learned thus far. Yes, and especially for someone doesn't know about autism or someone they just get diagnosed that their kids are, has autism because I remember that feeling when I heard the my kids my have autism the word from the teacher it was so heartbreaking. I loved my son so much that I didn't want to hear what anybody said. For me, he was normal. He was fine. He's just a baby and he's gonna grow past it. At first, you have that denial. But over time, I started to get interested because an, an emotional connection was not forming naturally. Mm. I mean, my kiss was a little different. I mean, he was so attached to me. It's not like he doesn't want to hug me or something like that. But he doesn't talk and also he was keep making line like not the meaningful just repeating some he did everything pretty good it was just speech oh and eye contact yes and then he doesn't keep have that much of a face expression that's what i didn't see then the emotional connection when i mean connection he's talking to you he's looking at you he wasn't there it, you didn't notice it because you didn't care because you love him so much and that was as a result of the spectrum uh, what i wanted to say was i wanted to inform the world about just the autism awareness it's a spectrum everybody are different if you experience with autism you just got diagnosed autism don't be afraid like that it's fixable you can teach they can you, learn and it's you not you can adapt that's what you want to say it is something you can adapt no it's not they can learn it's not like they are autism they gonna be so severe and you think they don't um it's different, they can, right? everyone, yeah, everyone different. different but if you start to teach them early earlier is better so don't be afraid to get a diagnosis and get ABA service or something work try to develop their skills with the visual card or those things it's not harming you anyhow it's okay with uh, just uh, general keys to learn that part it's not like you gotta take a medicine but people just are so afraid the world of autism so they don't wanna get diagnosed they don't wanna go you know start that program so i want you to you know tell people this kind of story and it's okay i mean autism is all different it might not be worst scenario as you think but what if it is worse what if it is bad it although is... it's bad earlier you know and have education can help you the better yeah, yeah. The, better, the sooner you know the better right so don't be afraid that's what i want you to inform people to start to have this review and everything but i learn more from people mm. even it means we know what we know, but there's so much more that we can learn from others that are out there. Right. I learned so, a lot I mean, from the feedback. And this is kind of why we enjoy what, we, what we're doing. I feel really blessed mm. to have this old feedback and people. The opportunity. Yeah. yeah. Let us know what you think about episodes 7 and 8. Did you guys already know? That that woman is on your woo's mom, and were well, you guys as shocked as I was? Babe, I am sure my mouth was like here. <laughs> you know, one secret I had. What? I knew she's the mom. You knew? Yeah. How? You because... watched somebody else's? No. How did you know? Somebody say that in the comments. Oh, God. Thank God.
I am not listening but to this I, I cannot say anything. You only tell me important things. I'm, I'm not don't saying anything. Tell me. No, I never. I don't yeah. want to know. It's going to be interesting. Someone knows that. Is there someone Oh my god, I am know? so happy you're not. You have an interest in me not knowing because I am having so much fun because I, I like the way I'm connecting the yeah. dots. And it's like, boom, I knew it. Boom, I knew it. It's just so lovely. That is what I'm enjoying. I don't want it to stop. Now I'm kind of scared of how they're going to end this thing. What if they end it in a way I don't like? Well, I don't think about that. I, I, I don't want to. I'm sure some people in the comments just say, Hey, what happens next in this? Oh, I cannot, I cannot read the comments anymore then. Yeah, yeah don't. please. Don't. Yeah, so don't spoil it for us. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. <laughs> yeah, we really enjoyed the show. And thank you so much for giving us nice comments. Let us know what you think, how much, what you thought, and and we apologize. We know we take a little bit of time to publish the episodes. It's just a lot of work and we don't want to make it without our kind of sauce. But I feel like we are making together. It's not only me. Mm. You know, the comments and everything is making, we are making together. Makes it fun. Thank, thank you for being here. Ooh, that's mine. <laughs> <laughs> Chego. Thank you. Kamsamnida. Kamsamnida. Mm. Say it one more time. It was so off. Do it together. Kamsamnida. Okay. Kamsamnida. Okay. Do it again. Kamsamnida.